and we just <laughs> I'm just kidding. This and like a condition called love and a couple other series, Apothecary Diaries, um, are series I've been looking forward to since they were announced and I'm just, oh, the fact that we're getting in like together is amazing. Hey beautiful people, welcome back to Two Cents Beat. My name is Sadi and today we are going to be checking out A Sign of Affection. Ah, I'm so excited. I was so excited. Granted, take this with a grain of salt because I've only actually read up until volume three or I've read uh, volume three. I haven't read volume four yet and on. So <laughs> like I realized that just now as I was pulling them off of my shelf, like, wait a minute, I don't think I've read this much. It's my bad habit of like, I don't want a series to end. So I'm just going to stop it right in the middle. So I don't have to think about how it's, it's, ending even though this isn't even ending it's still ongoing so it's the same thing i did with apothecary diaries where i just read up until volume five i think and then i i haven't read any more way to be predictable me anyway the volumes i did read of this series i absolutely love a sign of affection is such a sweet and wholesome and just engaging story that i am so excited that the series is actually getting an anime because now we get to experience this story but with like music and movement and voice acting like the story is going to become it's just going to come to life even more you know and i'm just so ready for it I'm so ready. I'm so curious to see how they're going to do everything. So for people who don't know, A Sign of Affection follows a college student named Yuki who is deaf. She has been deaf since she was born. So she communicates with sign language, hence the title, A Sign of Affection. While she's at college, she meets this guy who is kind of like a world traveler. This guy is like very charismatic. He speaks multiple languages, but he doesn't speak sign language. And so that that curiosity or that interest it was, is what creates a relationship between the two. But the story just gets so good and it's so cute. I loved it so much to the point where I, I had the opportunity to purchase another one of their series and I bought the whole thing. And I've been reading that. I've actually read more of that series than this one. <laughs> Oops. But I feel like that's enough fangirling. How about we just jump on into this episode and see what's gonna happen. Uh, let's go. Hmm. Okay. Oh. Wow, such a poet. Oh, the colors are gorgeous. Oh. Oh, and then it turned, it, it, it was so vibrant. It was so saturated and then it just desaturated. What happened? Oh my gosh. Oh, oh, her. I remember her. Okay. And then you cute. Oh, I should have looked who the artist is. I always forget to do this. I'm sorry, guys. But I'm so excited. Oh, her friend. Oh, that was cute. I think he signed something. Those are lips, though. Oh, he's back, back, no! Oh, wow. They're doing his tattoo really prominently. Novel Bright. Whoa. <laughs> oh, I love her so much. They are so cute. Oh my god, okay, I wasn't expecting that. Are you 
like he's it's so cute and delicate and feminine it's oh i love this so much already just so much Mm -hmm. and then oh that was a good that was a good transition i like that Hi. this is my world oh <laughs> all those green eyes oh yeah <laughs> oh no <laughs> he's not getting it oh my god the footsteps it's so dramatic <laughs> Oh my god, those lips! <laughs> I guess that makes sense, because she she can... Hmm, let me not say that. Yet. Oh, she recognizes him! Mm. He's so cute! He's like, Timba bye That was cute. I love that they're giving him a little bit of a tan. Okay, yeah, they're putting in they're putting effort into the signs. This is what I was hoping to see. Mm -hmm. He has no idea. Oh, oh. Oh. He's so close. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> he's just staring at her. Oh my god, he's so close. Oh. That's kind of... Mm. Oh, he's speaking slower too. Mm -hmm. Oh my god, I love him already. I love this already so much. Oh... <gasps> that was so cool. He's so tall. <laughs> oh. Oh my god. Ah, we're getting such good series this season. It's I'm going to cry. <laughs> Was her heart? Oh. <gasps> I'm getting, um, guys, I'm getting so emotional right now. I'm gonna cry. I feel like, I don't know, I feel like the style, they changed the art style a little bit. Yeah, it's not quite, it's not quite like an exact replica of the manga. Not that it needs to be. Like, I'm quite liking this. I just, it's just something I noticed. Oh. Mm -hmm. Oh, from Canada. Ah. Mm -hmm. This giant, like, duffel bag. It's so. <laughs> it's like a huge jump. Oh. Maybe, probably. Mm -hmm. I love her friend. Oh. Oh, Or is it this way? <laughs> oh, she's really crushing. You're a great gal! <laughs> I'm loving the attention to like their nails, their lips, like everything is just so cute and feminine. I love it! <sighs> oh. <laughs> Look at her. She's like, no, I want to know about him. Get their deets! <laughs> Oh dear, she's so nervous. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Their friendship is great. Oh, there he 
Jeez, oh my god. <laughs> what is this? What are they watching? <laughs> I feel like that looked familiar. Mm -hmm. oh. 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 Mm. He's crush worthy too. 100%. My gosh. His hand just covers her whole face. I know. He's just. Try a race board for her. Oh, yeah. The effort this man goes to to be able to communicate with her, just ah. That's what a crush does. Trilingual. <laughs> He's like, is it really? <laughs> <laughs> now he's just oh he's studying Spanish Ooh. oh 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 and I think that was it that was the moment when he started trying to impress her oh 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 the English isn't too bad <laughs> oh I didn't the green one yeah yeah She wants to be. She wants to experience things with him. It's wet. Oh! Good job, Rita. Let's go. Good job. Oh. Oh no. Oh no. She's starting to get. She's starting to doubt herself. Mm. And just puts it down. She thinks she can't broach his world. <sighs> uh -oh. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> oh goodness, that startled me! <laughs> See, Rin is that is a that is a friend right there. Yeah. Instantly, like yes. <laughs> oh, I suddenly got the feeling like, oh my god, we're actually here. We actually have a sign of affection. This is for real. <sighs> it was a surreal moment for a second. Oh no. Mm -hmm. It just instantly starts walking on that side. Oh, and holding her hand. Oh my god. They're so cute. I can't. I can't with how adorable they are. Oh, that's cool. Wow. Oh. I'm sure you can tell. Oh my gosh! <laughs> she did it! Oh, he's trying to speak to her in sign language! New friends, let's go. <gasps> yeah, it's huge. It's so me, Sankara. It's so me, Sankara, Mira Sekaiwa. Dorekura Hiro in the row. What do you say? What do you say? Oh my god. 
I forgot about that line. Totally forgot about that line. Oh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> she just <laughs> bro I'm crying <laughs> oh my god the music got to me the dang music got to me but that was so precious oh. goodness I'm crying over here guys and they're over here talking too so yeah this is not like your typical a romance where like they don't they don't end up talking until like the last episode. It's pregnancy. Are you thinking about it? Oh my god! Oh, the music! Goodness, the music in this series is too powerful. I knew what was coming, and yet here I am, like practically bawling my eyes out. <sighs> Wow, we're just getting banger episodes after banger episodes this today. Like, this is great, guys. Oh my goodness. This is exactly what I wanted because the story itself is amazing. But then having that in conjunction with like amazing sound and music and voice acting is just like oh my god i i didn't cry while reading the manga but here i am over, over here like almost crying <laughs> pretty much crying with the first episode oh, i really hope more people watch it because this is this is such a good series i want more people to know about this what are my thoughts aside from just fangirling over how amazing of an episode it was one thing that we don't get in the manga as much is yuki utilizing her sign language because obviously the manga is just like still images, right? But now with the anime, we actually get to see that. And I think that was a big part of how the creators wrote the story. Like they really researched and took a deep dive into how to translate sign language into manga panels. Because obviously they can't communicate the whole thing, the whole sentence that they're trying to. So it's like what key parts need to be like emphasized in order to get the message across but now we're able to see like the entire message even though obviously i don't understand japanese sign language but seeing it it's like it feels like the animators also took it upon themselves to like really put forth that effort to translate like even um itomi's lips when he was trying to like speak slower so that she could read his lips felt like it took twice as long to do because of like them trying to really match like the vowels and like the lip movements and everything so oh, i just i love the fact that they that the series isn't just like oh yeah typical lip flaps blah 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 no they're really taking the time to flesh the story out in not just like pretty colors and gorgeous animation but also like the finer details i'm gonna this series is so oh. Just keep crying over here because it's so good. I don't know. Maybe I'm just emotional today. Our main characters have met. They have exchanged numbers. They've exchanged deets. Their story just continues from here. And at least I think, I don't know if it's ever confirmed, but I think we saw the moment where like Itsumi fell for Yuki in this episode too. Or I guess we saw two moments. One where he's like, uh, telling her all the languages that he speaks with the the whiteboard, right? And then that's like where his interest is getting peaked even more. But then when she does her little like happy dance, that's when, at least I like to believe that that's when he really falls for her. And obviously we know Yuki's had a crush on him like since they first met, basically. They're already catching feelings for each other and it's only the first episode. <sighs> but now we gotta wait until the next episode to see where their story goes. So until next time, let me know what you guys thought of this episode in the comments down below. Thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure to like and subscribe if you liked this video. Check out the socials for more anime and manga content. Check out Patreon for early access and longer episode reactions. Don't forget to drink some water, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Bye!